My father recently passed away. The curse of this winter took him. I'm sorry for your loss. It is a tragedy. Okay. I'm uh, Okay. That was... Uh, that was not bad. So, our uncle is a cool guy. And we're gonna steal his book. And he can teach us magic. I wish my uncle can teach me magic. Principles of the craft. The five elements coexist within the magician's soul in an eternal process of devouring. As water doses fire, so fire sees the spirit. Spirit possesses air. Air scourges earth. And earth dispels water. This is what is known as the elemental cycle, or the seculorium, as it has lately been named. The magicians who would follow the path of pure elemental magic must understand the power and the danger inherent in the balance or imbalance of the five elements. Firstly, I will speak of power. The young mage as he will begin to study will possess one fifth part of each of the elements. As his mastery of an element increases to the fourth part, he will begin to become more resistant to magical attacks based on that element. As his mastery increases to the third part, he will become immune to those elemental spells, and should he master of an element past the second part, he can draw strength from elemental spells cast upon him. Now I must also speak of danger. <laughs> Consider the mage who works many magics of fire. He will find his mastery of elements of fire growing, but the elemental of what within his soul will consume less of that fire and will weaken as his fire grows within. Thus, his vulnerability to the element of what will increase as his studies progress. Weigh four pounds. I, I'm doing magic. This is kind of anticlimactic. I was. I was expecting more drawings and shh, fireball. Let me see. Level. Big level. Mana points. 15. Element fire. Target. No target. And the description is the perfect spell for getting someone's attention. Poor damage. But a good leading spell before combat. I'm going out. Hello. Where did my uncle disappear? Uncle! 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 Where are you? Uncle! I must not disappoint my uncle. He gave me a book and a, a cozy worm bed. Now I need to give him gold. He didn't say how much gold I needed to give him. 200 gold! Oh shit! So, how much do we have right now? Okay, let's not despair. Things are not really that bad. We're gonna work for that Barthelgo guy, and I'm sure we're gonna manage to pay him in a, a day or two. Let's go to the convenience store. Hello. Hi. Hello. Alfonso. You are the Spanish king, Alfonso. Looking for something in particular? I want to trade. Hmm. I want to see stuff. I have a mountain compass. I don't need two mountain compass. And I want to buy. I want to buy apples. 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 I'm running out of money. I think it's not for today. A bag. I want a bag. Give me a bag. I want this sack. Sack. What is sack? This sack. This big sack. Okay. Tell me about this guy. Now there's a man in whom you should place as little trust as possible. Bath Algo has not been here long. Turned up and started his shop last spring. But in that short time he's made few friends. He'll cheat you too. Just you see. An unscrupulous and arrogant man if ever I saw one. Oh. Thanks. Then I bid you good day. I bid you a good day too. And I'm gonna work I'm gonna work with an unscrupulous man. That's no good. Maybe he'll trick me, he'll make me work for him, and he will not pay me. And where the heck does this Barthelico guy use apothecary? Yet in. That's what she said. Hello. Barthelico. Hmm, the vagrant. 
What could you possibly want? Oh, shut up. Work? Seeking gainful employment, are we? You finally realize that vagrancy doesn't pay. Well, there is something. <laughs> I am an alchemist, which you would know from the sign above my door, if you could but read. <laughs> and so I require herbs. Locate any... anything, so long as it's useful, and I will give you a little coin. I can't say fairer than that now, can I? Okay. You do realize later on I'm gonna kill you, okay? Because you're being a dick, and I'm gonna work for you, and I'm gonna buy a big hammer, and I'm gonna crush your ass. Trade festival. I'm sure you are looking forward to it. Mm -hmm. The chance to stuff your face with the fruits of others' labors. And a chance for us all to merrily sing songs around the faith stone. What oh, drivel. Huh. Drivel. How dare you. Okay. But it sounds so nice. <gasps> look. Look, 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 look. Look, 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 look. That's... That looks similar to... The drawing done by the... Uh, the, the drawing done by Da Vinci. But it needs another man sitting in a... Square. Oh, okay. Let's go. Come on, go! It's a freaking door! You need to learn how to use a door, man. You're old enough to... to grasp the concept of entering and exiting a door. I'm gonna go this way right now. Going, going, going. Is this door... <gasps> this door is open right now. I can go in and find out what's... What the heck is this place? You're a witch. Can you tell me the future? Melissa, somehow I already know your name. That's peculiar. Your soul resounds with destiny, spirit singer. How may I guide thee? Mm, work? I do have a small task that needs to be done. I require the eggshells from a snow dove's nest for my work. However... The fledglings must have left the nest for the shells to be of any use. I believe there are snow doves in the mountains to the west. I will pay you for any eggshells you find. You gonna pay me if I bring you eggs? Shells? Okay. The Rahl were the servants of the Revenants. Their eyes and ears. The demon papers, manuscripts from the Horoth Empire, tell their tale in detail. Such things are confined to history and have not been seen in many centuries. So this rod is very rare. Nobody ever seen one in these parts, but I'm lucky enough to see it. Yep. That's luck. Oh, thank you. What I have given you is the first part of the Demon Papers. A tale of the League of Six, the Demon Revenants from long ago. This is the first of four parts, though I know not where the other three are. Hmm. The hex is part of a greater design, used by Harbinger to learn the secrets of the world and to perform powerful magic. Its symbol was that of the tree, the tree of being, and it is said that when Harbinger created the hex, he sacrificed a part of himself. Its design was of the spirit, the path through life, and the magic locked within the soul. Uh, tell me about Jake. I, I, I don't think I met him. I do not know the man, but I sense he is connected to something... something sinister. Of his inclusion and innocence I know not, but I see an image around his name, that of a severed head and three steel blades. Hmm, maybe he's connected to the Rawl. Okay. Farewell then, and may the spirits guide you. So I need to find some eggshells for you because, I don't know, you like omelets. Let's, let's investigate this house. The door is broken. Look, somebody broke in. I'm gonna broke in as well. Hey, Chant, hello Chant. I'm gonna investigate this box. It's empty. How could you Chant? I thought you were friends. That bookshelf is, is in the wall. And I'm gonna steal your ham. And I'm gonna click this box. Don't mind me, I'm just doing stuff in the back of your house. Bum, bum, bum. 
this place is cool for a mini study room or a mini office, you know? It would be nice and intimate and cozy. Ah, you're standing near the fire, I see. Uh, hello? Destiny crosses our paths once again, Blood of Andrus. Blood of Andrus. Hmm. Raal are heralds of evil, demons from the pit of darkness. They do not act alone, however. Always they serve a powerful master. Oh. So there's something even bad there? Bad is, is there something more dangerous than a Raal around here? I'm screwed. I'm screwed. I'm screwed. I'm screwed. I'm, I, I can't open that door. Ooh, an apple in the tree. But it, this tree looks so dead and that apple looks like a trap. Well, it was not a trap. Something behind this house, except the river and a couple of boxes. I'm gonna investigate the boxes. I'm gonna interrogate them. Hmm, tell me what you... Oh, okay, okay. You are bribing me. Okay, Mr. Box. I'm gonna take your bribe and pretend nothing happened. You're empty. Okay. Let's continue. Let's continue. Let's continue. This house has no windows. Okay, it has it has two windows. It's not that bad. You have some chocolate. Ah, a traveller in need of refreshment, eh? What'll it be? I'm looking for work. In need of gold, eh? Yep. Well, I can't pay you, but deliver this to Jake and I'm sure he'll furnish your purse for the trouble. It arrived here two weeks ago, but he hasn't been to collect it yet. You can find him out on the old Johnson farm. Go west from here, then north when you come to the farms. Look for the pass. His place lies beyond. You can't miss it. Absolutely. Okay. There'll be a beer waiting. <laughs> Thanks. Let's find Jake. Apparently this Jake fellow could not retrieve his package. Maybe something happened to him. We'll need to go and verify. But later, right now, we seek quests. Oh my goodness, is this a church? Looks like one, it's a strange one, but I'm gonna go in it. Hello. Oh my, this is not a church. It's like a meeting hall. Hmm. Is there someone there? Oh, hello. Hey! Town elder. You must be the wise guy. Boo! Didn't scare you? Ah, you must be the young fellow staying with Andrus. Yep. I am Elric, the town elder. Hi. I look after this library and ensure that the traditions and rules of the city are adhered to. Now, how can I help you? Hmm, I'm looking for work. Ah, yes, work. Let me see. In my official capacity of town elder, I have some work available. I also have a small task of a personal note that I need some help with. Which are you interested in? Both. But first, work for Madrigal. As you may have noticed, there have been a number of disappearances lately. Yeah. The farms to the west are almost empty, and many of the townsfolk are missing too. Also, there have been many more brigands in the area than before. I saw. I will offer you two rewards. A hundred gold coins for finding and rescuing the missing townsfolk and farmers, and another hundred gold coins for the bounty on the leader of the brigands. Two hundred gold! That will solve all our problems. Let's see the extra work. The more private nature. I have been looking for a manuscript. The Demon Papers, by Raffaella of Horath. Now there are four parts, of which I have but one. I will gladly buy them off you if you find them. I have one of those. That nice lady, Melissa, gave me one. Tell me about the casket. You got this from Will, you say? Yeah. Well, I cannot make out the seal. It is obscured by some sort of magic. Perhaps you should show this to Melissa, or that new alchemist. Hmm. You know what? Not bad. I shall... I shall listen to your advice. Jake? Ah, yes, that old chap. 
Well, he comes to town to pick up his deliveries every now and then. I believe he's in the antiques business. Import, export, that sort of thing. I made the trip out to the old estate when he first arrived last summer. To extend a welcoming hand, you understand. Well, you've never seen so many books, charts and curios. His shelves and cabinets put my library to shame. <laughs> Wise guy. The festival. The festival has a long tradition in Madrigal. During the festivities, we touch the faith stone and make a wish to bring luck and prosperity on the town. It doesn't seem to bring any, but it's the custom. And who am I to break that? The Raal were once very evil men, granted immortality by the League of Six. Their demonic lord, Scorn, sought to break the world, to devour mankind and drink of their souls. But in the end, Scorn and his allies were thwarted by a powerful warlock and the magic he wielded against them. It is not known if Scorn was truly defeated, young fellow, for his minions still surface here and there where evil is found. Some say he is expectant, not quite dead, his spirit waiting for the time when he is strong enough to return to the world and put the land to the sword once more. The Hex? Ah, yes. It is a thing part of a great design known as the Tree of Being and was employed by Harbinger to summon avatars and master the secrets of powerful magic. The design of the star is a representation of the soul of man and in Harbinger's death became a symbol of power and authority over all demons. Oh my goodness! Two thousand gold, book of cloaks, book of knives, trap, Tarvin's journal, book of history one and four and winter folk and oh, so many beautiful stuff. I'm gonna go now. Oh, it's been a pleasure to talk to one so full of youth and life. Come back any time. Yep, thank you for the information. I'm not full of youth and life. I just stood there and listened to everything you had to say. That was not even a conversation, that was a monologue. But who cares? I'm gonna go now. So, I should show this casket to, um... The new alchemist. The new alchemist is a dick. And to Melissa. Because apparently it's some strange magic and maybe that's why... Jake didn't came for the package. Jake hates magic. Berthelago. Hmm, the Vagrant. What could you possibly want? Show casket. This is yours? Well, not actually mine, but... Ah, now I understand, yes. I shall dig out my best Thardal in red. I always have a bottle or two in hand for prestigious occasions such as this. If you wish to purchase from my humble apothecary in the meantime, my lord, then I will see to it that you receive the appropriate rebate for a man of your undoubted and distinguished cloth. If there is anything you wish to ask me, I shall put all my knowledge at your immediate disposal. Never fear, my lord, I shall tell no one of this. It can remain our little secret, yes? Hmm. No, no, my lord, your enemies are mine. But as we know, they shall be dealt with soon enough. Do not bloody your hands on my account. Well, I know a little of warlock's hexes. My recent discoveries led me to believe that the stone on the green has something to do with one. But try as I might, I cannot expose the magic, nor its workings. The festival? Ah, yes, I have something special in mind this year. If I am at last to bring my work here to an end, it shall be then. What better time could there possibly be? You're acting very strange right now. Maybe this crate... No, this crate. Maybe this box is more dangerous than I thought. This is fishy. And to go to Melissa. Right away. Maybe she knows something. Melissa, you won't believe it. Something strange and peculiar Your happened. soul resounds with destiny, spirit singer. How may I guide thee?
Tell me about this casket. Hmm. The emblem upon the casket is magically masked, but not so much that I cannot discern it. The emblem shows three knives, one on top of another. Perhaps it's a coat of arms. Ask Chant. He may know its source from his travels. Hmm. Demon papers vow Jake show casket. Farewell, then, and may the spirits guide you. Okay, we need to go to Chant. Chant, I came with grave news. I need your expertise in weapons and stuff. Don't be shy. Destiny crosses our paths once again, Blood of Andrus. Yes, yes, of course. Tell me about... I would advise you to be rid of this with all haste. Tell me, how did this come to you? Through Will Farshaw. The casket was left with him to be collected by a man called Jake. Jake lives on the old estate to the north of the farms. The casket has a symbol of evil on it, though magic masks its true form. Hmm. Melissa, Melissa said something about Seal of Three Knives. Three Knives? Yeah. That is the seal of the Guild of Assassins in Shadowguard. Oh my. You would be best to rid yourself of it as quickly as you can. The Guild? The Guild of Assassins is a ruthless, mercenary guild allied with the powers of darkness. I would not be surprised if they used summoned demons to do their bidding, shadows, and even Raal. Hmm. Okay. So the demons are using this Guild of Assassins as some kind of mercenaries. I can see. Well, actually I cannot see, but I can presume. Hey, I didn't saw that open. Let's try going in here. This garage was not open before. <gasps> You're the blacksmith. Yep. Where's the blacksmith? <laughs> Welcome to Madrigal, lad. I've heard a lot about you already. The tongs in this place wag faster than the tail of a dog. I'm Hammer, by the way. The finest smith in the area. Now, what can I be doing for you? Well, Hammer, I'm looking for work. Looking to line your purse, are you, lad? Yeah. Well, maybe we can help each other out. I need ore, you see, both iron and diamond iron. Any you find, I'll pay you in gold. There used to be a diamond iron mine out on the western hills, come to think of it. But it's long deserted now, and I doubt if the miner's left without bleeding it dry. But you never know. Well, if you strike lucky, come and see me and I'll buy it off you. West, you say? West is near Jake. Until next time, lad. Walk well. Thank you. This is west. How west is this? Hmm. This is not west now. Hello! There's another bandit. You're gonna... Nah. Nah, nah, nah. I've dodged you. But I'm gonna use the club. Wait, 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 wait. Two hand smash. I mean, two hand smash you in the head. You're gonna cry. Once again. Bam. You dead. You dead. In your arm is bleeding. Okay, confiscating the bread. Thank you. I'm gonna get lost. I need to go on the other exit. Raven's car. Hmm. Sounds nice. Let's go. We need to go to the west. This is perfect. More brigades. More brigades. No, no brig. Uh, okay, never mind. Hmm. Two hand smash. No, let's try underarm smash. Quicken! We missed! I missed again! I hit him! I missed again! Bam! You're dead! Level up! That's perfect! You dropped an apple, gold, and a fish, and you have more apples there.
Let's see what we can do. Two, two, one and one. That's good. Okay, I think that's it. Yep, we can continue. Let's go... Let's go here, because they, they said the people are missing and stuff, and we should go this way. But first... What's combo? Uh... Is this a combo? Am I doing something wrong or right? I have no freaking idea. Hopefully, I'm not gonna die. I'm gonna call you... Smashy Smash. Yep, let's go. Oh, but it's nothing here. Oh, look, 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 look. It's a fire. And they're like, free view. I'm gonna smash, smash, smash your face. I'm gonna use a combo. And My friend, you should take more care yeah. on the road. Some people will do anything for a coin or two. Fight me! Uh, oh shit, I'm gonna die, I'm gonna die, come on! No! Oh my god. Yep, that, that, that was close. Chicken, cow, chicken, chicken, cow, chicken, chicken, cow, chicken. I'm gonna take your apple, confiscate everything, give me this. So this combo thing is very cool, I don't need to click Continuously, I just click the combo and uh, and I'm lost. I see you. I'm gonna kill you. Come on here. Don't run. What you doing? Come here. Come on. Get here. Come on. Come back. Screw you. Come here. You son of a. Come here. Come on. Come here, you dumbass. Ah, now you fight me. Eh? Hit points you have? Uh, that's a lot. You dead. You thought you can run, eh? You thought you can outrun me. Or you can defeat me. Now you're down. You're on the cold ground. And you're bleeding. Hope you're happy. Ooh, a short bow. Gimme, gimme, gimme. Time to replenish our strength. Yum, yum, yum. Going in the snow. Everything so cold. I wanna to go home and stuff. Where am I? I think this is the way. Is this the way? Hopefully. Hello. I have no freaking idea where I, where I'm right now. This place is huge. I'm confused. Yep. This place is huge. Look, a herb! Gimme! Gimme! Pick the herb. Hmm. Caravan. Uh, this is like a house. Move away from the door, stranger, unless you want this bolt through your belly. Nice and slow. Now. Who sent you? Will Farshaw sent me. He gave me a parcel to deliver to you. A parcel, eh? You'd better come inside then. You go in first. I'll join you when I know it's safe. Nice house. Wow, this must be the library he was talking about. Now, tell me exactly why you are here. It sounds like Lord Crux's coat of arms. Crux is a noble merchant in Shadowguard. He is rich, but not a man to trust. I don't know anything about them. I am a man who collects curios and antiques. That is why I receive packages from Shadow Guard. I have no interest in murderers and cowards. 
You had better hurry up and get to the point. I don't like the direction this conversation is going. Raal are powerful demons, summoned by evil men to do their bidding. Either say what you came here to say or leave. You are trying my patience. Uh. All I can say is this. Trust Chant. If anyone knows what is really going on, he is the one. This parcel is for me. From Shadow Guard. Well, I bet you're curious to know what is inside. You open it. I don't trust packages from Shadow Guard. Um. Uh. Yeah. There you go. I'm gonna drop it on the floor. Drop it like it's hot. Drop it like it's hot. Oh my. The Guild, Father. The Guild is coming. Your aid to the Bloodkin Prince has not gone unnoticed. Karen? My son? Why? What sorcery is this? The master has ordered you silenced. 